this is a, a hefty, yeah, this is, I'm sorry, this is a brute, a hefty brute. You can get these at any hardware store. They're about $25. They come with a solid lid, and this is a real strong material. Works exactly the same as your sump liner from you know the basin itself. Same size, 32 gallons, two feet deep. So what we have to do is go ahead and perforate that. So we're gonna use a big drill. We're gonna put holes all the way around it, a couple in the bottom so it doesn't float up. We're gonna surround this pit with gravel. That, that allows the water to just percolate right into your sump pump, into your sump pit. Some pump lifts it up, takes it away. One other thing that we're going to do here is we're going to drill a four inch hole right in the side of the pit that is for the footer tile to be added in the future because I know that this, crump, this crawl space is going to need to have a footer tile. So, but right now the homeowner is just saying put the sump pump in there and the discharge, so that's what we're doing. But this will be able to attach the gravel perforated pipe, four inch pipe. Let's go ahead and drill this hole. Our, our entry point so this will be where the footer tile will attach in the future you can easily drill another hole in the other side we're actually going to give them a small piece of gravel perforated pipe that really helps the water come in when it starts to rain so you can see all the holes that we just put all over this sump liner and again what that's doing is it allows there's going to be gravel out here on the outside Water comes through the gravel, enters through the holes, into the pit, sump pump, lifts it up, carries it away. So let's go ahead and install So we're just adding a little piece of footer tile to go in this hole right here. The simplest way to do it is to just go ahead and slice it and squeeze it together. Remember that this is already perforated, so this, this little section doesn't make any difference at all. It just helps water get into your pipe faster. We're gonna put that down the pit. Then we're just going to pour gravel over top of that area here as well as all the way around it. Just get it to drop down in. So let's go ahead and set up the sump pump. Hey, this is Chuck with Apple Drains reminding you that if you believe you can do something, I guarantee you can do it. Have a great day.